I wouldn't want Domino to miss his party. What party? Oh, Come on, I'll take you back to the hospital. Now, just hang on a second. Look, I owe you one. You know, I, I appreciate what you did. I want to... I'm in a hurry, Frisco, so just forget it, okay? At least let me apologize. That's all I'm trying to do. All right. You've said it. Now, let's go. Hey, wait a second. What the hell are you so short about? I'm not happy about it. I'm just doing a favor for a friend. What are you talking about? I'm talking about this. It's a train ticket. Big deal. Well, Felicia asked me to pick it up for her. Felicia? She's going away this afternoon. Don't ask me why, because I don't know why. You're supposed to deliver this. I said I would at the award ceremony. All right. Well, listen, why don't you give me a ride over there, and I'll take care of the delivery part, okay? Come if on. I keep hanging out with Come you, on. pretty please, soon I'm, I'm going to be put on permanent me. suspension. And I to honor those among you who have taken up our task and who have displayed an extraordinary commitment and courage in the preservation of democracy and justice. On behalf of the WSB, therefore, it's my pleasure to see that these people get their recognition and to see that each of you, each of you receive a commendation especially authorized by the agency. <laughs> well, first, the WSB is proud to award its first commendation to a man who has long been associated with the agency, both as a former WSB agent and now as the police commissioner of Port Charles, a man you all know and respect, a friend to everyone, Robert Scorpio. We'll continue in a moment. I'm going back. Hey, what is it with you, huh? You're just going to take off, no goodbyes? I don't even rate a goodbye. I went to the hospital to see you, and you were gone. Well, I'm not too tough to find. Yeah, so what else is new? You're always thinking of yourself. You don't even know what I'm going through. Wait a minute. What about my feelings, huh? I mean, is it that easy for you to walk away from our marriage and everything that we've meant to each I'm other? I'm not walking away. Well, what do you call it? I'm going to my grandmother's hacienda where I can take time and think about things and sort out my feelings. What about my feelings? Hmm? Listen, Colton may let you get away with this, but I don't plan Please on don't it. don't talk about Colton like that. Remember I said I was going to leave town if I nailed Domino? Yes. What if I'd have done that? What if I'd have just taken off? I don't know what you want me to say. I want you to say that I mean something to you. You know, what happened to the woman that stood over me when I was shot, right? That was at the hospital caring about me? Where'd that all go? You make me sound like I'm some kind of light switch where I can turn things off and on. But I can't do that to my feelings, and you're not making things easier for me. I'm trying to find the answer for both of us. I can't do it by being possessive. I have to decide this for myself. And I have decided I'm going away, and I don't know when I'll be back. Is that all I mean to you? <laughs> well, have a nice trip, okay? Don't bother to write. <laughs> The recipient of our next award is a woman who is already internationally known and respected for her impressive musical talent. I refer, of course, to one of poor Charles's most prominent citizens, Catherine Delafield. never seen her before but she is a pretty one that's for sure obviously someone out of robert's past 
Where now, why would you say that? All I did was basically oh, grab Cal The way she looks at Robert. Anyone with that kind of a gleam in her so eye has well. a reason. Oh, you now. read too many mystery novels. Yeah. You're damn right. Yeah. No. Uh, I had a great time. Thank, Thank you very you. much. And uh, next, we have another heroic and courageous citizen who demonstrated a remarkable courage in the uh, pursuit of justice. Yes, uh, this is a name that will be on the lips of all Port Charles citizens for a long time to come. Grace Rose Malofsky. Who's that? Grace, come on, man. Come on. Grace Rose Malofsky. Can you please come up? Oh, there's And now, this award goes to a man whose direct action resulted in the capture, and I'm sure it'll be the certain conviction, of Nicholas Van Buren, uh, more widely known in terrorist world as the infamous Domino. I, of course, am referring to a man who has clearly demonstrated his dedication far beyond the call of duty, Colton Shore. So this was not a big deal to me, but I just, I don't understand why you had to get up in the middle of the ceremony and walk out. I didn't want to miss it. Frisco, right? He pulled me away from it. I, I really couldn't stop him. Couldn't stop him. That's kind of a reoccurring theme with you, isn't it? He was very upset that I was leaving town and I didn't tell him. That's why. So? Well, you told me and I'm your husband. Never mind. I wanted to tell you and Frisco both. That's why I went to yeah, the hospital. Yeah, well, I guess I'm lucky because you found me first. Huh? I explained it to you, Colton. I thought you understood. I am trying to understand, okay? I really am. I just... This is difficult. All right? My wife is walking away from me. Honey, please, can't you change your mind? Can't you stay? We can work this out. I know we can. We've tried. We can keep on trying and keep on trying until we get it right. I can't rent you a car. Why not? Your driver's license has expired. Look, I've been out of town, okay? I need the car. Hey, I'm sorry, I don't make the rules. Here, keep the change. Hey! Hey! 